Welcome back. Here we are at the winter semifinals, Vegas and Taroko. This week's top soccer players go on to challenge ranked hoops. This is going to be one of the strongest teams that ranked hoops has to offer. Nico and Manny. These guys are so good, but very different play styles. I imagine though, Taroko and Vegas, oh, they're going to get first blood off of a 50-50. I don't think that's how they expected the score. Vegas just directly underneath the ball as Manny <laughs> 50s it to him. Nika was prepared to uh, to tackle that 50 and said Manny, I mean, Manny is just always known for being so speedy and you just can't, you, you can take the speed away from the boy, but you can't take the boy away from, I don't know, <laughs> you get the idea. He's too fast, too fast for his own good. Dream Team with first blood. But uh, we see this a lot in, in ranked hoops. I guess, you know, once in a while, not a lot, but every couple of months, we see top soccer players challenge ranked hoops. And uh, sometimes they do pretty good, you know, getting uh, podiums frequently. Third place, second place, very rarely first place. I, don't, I can't even remember the last time I saw a team like this get first place before, but this could be the team that does it. That's gonna be a long send here. Nico going up behind and tries to get the dunk, but it's set away, Taroko underneath. Huge save. The lob there. Gonna go too far away. Taroko tries to go after, but now is in the wrong spot here. The pinch goes sideways back over to Nico. Nico's gotta be, if you've never played hoops before against Nico, Nico's gotta be one of the most frustrating players to play against. He just knows all the timings to take away boost to go for bumps. Um, he's just so, so tricky. If you don't see where he's at, you know he's up to something. He's excellent at setting up Manny as well. A great defender. But uh, the scoring opportunities definitely going to be heavily favoring Manny on this team comp. Nico goes screaming past that one. Taroko just lobs it. And now Manny suddenly has to retreat. But the demo is going to alleviate some of this pressure. Manny goes sideways hoping to get the 50-50. He goes upward. Nico's chasing this one, but he's not going to be in time to save instead. And he goes sideways. Nico repositions to the sidewall. But it will get ejected by the backboard defense. Manny has to... Redirect that one outside. Nico should be first one up to this. He's hesitating though. Back over to Vegas. Manny actually gets the block. I didn't think he had enough boost. So Manny will get the full boost on the way back. Still one to nil. Double up for Manny back out center. Taroko will lob that one as Nico gets the full boost. Just sends it sideways. A pinch goes past one. Tricky bounce here, Taroko's in trouble, he didn't realize it bounces straight into the net. I saw this coming a mile away. As soon as it bounces into this 45 degree corner, it always goes straight to the net. You gotta be so careful. I think Taroko was trying to half flip, land so that your car is facing upward and then dribble it away. And his car turned 90 degrees instead, which is painful. And that's the friendship tip off. Here comes the dunk. Oh, it never gets old. It is so powerful. It's gonna earn a goal here as Taroko just absolutely beat to the ball. The defense not expecting this whatsoever. So their previous opponents probably didn't pull that move off against them. And the Dream Team is probably shook just trying to figure out what happened. How did they get to the tip off so much faster? What is this hidden hoops tech? I'm sure that won't be the last time they'll see it tonight. That's gonna roll upward. Manny goes after it. Taroko has a good read on it though. Manny is super rimmed. Nico has no boost. He'll refill a couple of times. Now with 200 in the tank, it's not enough. Vegas goes right around him. We're all tied up two to two at the halfway mark. Great control here from Vegas. Just barely gets there. Doubling up on it, but it rolls off of the waterfall to go straight into the net. I have to wonder if Nico's gonna try a boop tip off at any point. Nope, it's gonna slow this one down. That sets Manny up nicely. He wants two. Vegas is ready for that redirect. It's a back pass to Nico. He wants a couple, he's waiting for it. He wants the defense to leave their, their parapet. I think that's the right word on the backboard. Just a touch here, but it only sets up Vegas. So Manny might be in trouble here. Vegas is gonna go too far. That will give Manny the tap. <laughs> Speaking of giving Manny the tap, Vegas takes him out. He's gonna launch that all the way to the net, but Manny tactically respawns. He's gonna be able to take that one away. Another block here though, is gonna keep things pinned down in the corner. Gonna be pretty hard for blue team to score, but keeps the pressure going. Manny's gonna send that backwards with a couple of pinches, giving Nico an opportunity here. Taroko demos Nico. Manny has to hold the line while Nico responds again. <laughs> he's taken out. Manny's off the ceiling though. He's got another touch. 
hardly makes any sense. Felt like those double demos should have uh, resulted in something. Manny getting two touches there is so key. It's a little bit shocking seeing Taroko go for back-to-back -back demos. Perfectly accurately figuring out where Nico is going to spawn. A nice save, though, by Nico, pinching it off of the rim. And Manny will sneak one past. Now it's just Nico here. Dwindling boost. Oh, he's got it! It saved away. Vegas chips it out. Very fine motor control there from Nico. No way. Manny taps it again. I don't know if that saved the ball or if it made it more dangerous. But either way, he didn't have a choice. Nico hoping he can pass it to Manny. Manny will let that one slide past him as Nico launches it. Vegas just chilling here in the lower corner. Still tied up 2-2. Two two. Next goal might be the winner. And Vegas is set up here. No, he doesn't have it. The shot instead. Going to go right to the front. Nice save there from Nico off the 45. Manny with no boost will just take the doink. The 50 goes to the ceiling. It's dangerous. It comes off the rim. Oh my gosh, the double bump! No way! It's not enough! It is enough. It will just sink in. Nico bumps one into the other from the rim. Poor Vegas almost has the block, but it is just a catastrophe. Nico hasn't been bumping all game, and it was just building up over and over again <laughs> until finally he had the line to take them both out. What a play. That's got to be a hard line to find, too. Like, uh, right next to the rim. You almost can't even see the players. No shot there for Manny. Dream Team needs to have a dream here in the final five seconds. Nico, ooh, it's almost a back pass, but it's too far away. That pinch going to set things up nicely. Manny's the first one to it. He gets bumped out of the way as Taroko goes forward, but one last attempt here at a shot. 100 boost here in the tank as Vegas slows it down. Going to take out the sidewall. That's a little bit awkward. He's lost it, and it's going to drop down. Nico and Manny take the first game. Man, it was neck and neck for so long, too. It's so scary. Nico is the reason I didn't get my SSL tournament title. <laughs> how, how did he keep it away from you? You guys run into each other in the finals or something? Or was he on your team and then, and then choked? <laughs> That'd be even funnier. Razor says, did Taroko ever play here before? I, I feel like it's a distant memory, but I think Taroko was invited to one of our, like, bigger tournaments. Ah, man. I might need um, some backup from chat. That's what I remember, but it's been a long time. Yeah, this time, this time Taroko's going to hang out on the backboard upon seeing that tip-off. So I do think that's the right move. You still got to send a car towards the ball. Throwing a hitbox in the way, but... Ooh, what a shot from the sidewall. Even Manny has to say, what a shot. Troco set up really nicely here from the sidewall. It's just right to the front of the net. Yeah, I think if you're going to be a backboard defender, you can't let your opponent dribble too close. You either got to go back down to the ground or uh, jump after him. But it's so scary off of the tip-off. Oh, Nico with reads. Lobs it upward, though. Manny just has to retreat, so that gives Taroko the possession. A solid 50-50 will send it all the way back to Vegas. Over to the side, Vegas is next up on it. Looks like he just wants the boost. It's gonna go mid. Over to the side, Manny with a redirect, trying to find Nico and snipe him in the process, but he will get the full boost with the wave dash into the ceiling. What's the play? Gets the demo on the way down. But I think he's all out of juice. Nico will go over to the side, taking the shot. That's just tricky enough to work. So remember, Taroko just respawned. He got taken out moments before. And so Nico looks like he's going to take a shot from the 45 and then turns in the last second to go up the wall instead. And the defense pre-jumped the shot. That's a crazy mix-up. One to one. Taroko said he hooped against Nico like six to seven years ago in some tourney. Yeah, I believe it. What a save. Manny flipping at just the right moment. Oh, it's past Nico. He recovers on the back wall, though. Falls after it. Doesn't get the touch. Fortunately, it's not in yet. We're still tied one to one. Vegas hesitates. It's going to have the reset here. It's over Nico. Back to Taroko. Off the sidewall. Side pass to Nico. Nope. 
bouncing and bouncing, but it's not going to be in yet. Manny misreads it. It's back over to Nico, though. The low shot saved away. The backboard defense takes it clear. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what Nico's supposed to do with that, but... Oh, he's missed the ball and the boost. That's painful. That means it's going to be up to Manny here. But loads of boost for the defense. They're going to be able to push out. Nico has to go past the boost. Manny fakes it. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't think that was planned. I'm just now remembering the first goal for the Dream Team in this series was uh, Manny hitting the ball off of Taroko's car and it went back into the orange net. Nico looking for bumps. Bouncing it off of the rim is so dangerous still. Is it just going to fall in? Taroko recovers in time to save it. Nico will turn back on this. Gets it with a lot of power. Looks like he wants the redirect here, but he's going to be slow. And the sidewall bounce for the shot. Nico takes one out. Taroko gets the read. Those backball reads are trickier than you might imagine, especially if you can't see it. Uh oh, no touch there. Vegas rushes back. Going to play the backboard defense. But Manny's up after it as well. Just catches it with one touch and tries to recover. Bounces it off of Taroko's car again. Deja vu. But, uh... Nope, over to the sidewall. Manny hoping to refill. The boost does not spawn in time. And he still doesn't have it. I wonder who took it. And Manny's going to just go back for it. No touch there for Taroko. Instead, it's Vegas over to the side. Manny pre-jumps it. He's way past it. As Vegas continues to go down the side. Look at that chain wave dash, too. is really clean, but Nico had that read. Manny, no touch for him. Nico instead lobs it up where he's going to bounce off the rim. No, Vegas gets the touch. The demo, though, Nico running amok underneath as everyone's craning their necks upward. Nico is taking that opportunity to take players out. Pass sideways to Vegas on the dribble. Lobs it up for the shot. Manny will catch it after the rim. He just wants the 50, but nice move there from Vegas, sending it sideways. He wants the redirect here. It's a nice shot. Nico is prepared on the back wall. He's just waiting for his opponents to go after him, but it won't bite. Nico's still struggling here, but he's allowed to just continue going forward. He dribbles around one. He wants one more touch to lob it up where the defense isn't ready for this. But Manny doesn't have the angle. Manny is bumped. There's no one left to take the shot. Manny will get a good block. Nice little redirect there from Nico. It sinks in. The rim is right in Taroko's way, but it feels like it should be savable, especially if you just sit down underneath. But, I mean, how many times can you get bumped before you're worried that's exactly what's coming? Two to one. Nico and Manny pull ahead again. The Dream Team I have to make this comeback in a minute. But it's just a fragile lead. Nice block there from Manny. Might line something up here. He's going to try it. Not enough boost to go back for the ball, but he wants to collect it on the ground instead. Doesn't get the full boost, though. That means Vegas and Taroko are both going to have full tanks. Taroko navigates around Nico. It's not in, though. Vegas will try to redirect it in. Still not enough. Back to Nico. A lob to Manny. He's going to take it to the ceiling. Just keeping the defense on their toes, making them react to everything. That might slow their rotations down, burn their boost. Back to Nico. He needs to be careful to demo. Yeah, he can hear Taroko right behind him. And he's got a full tank. And he is uh, trying to patiently wait for the moment. Nice save there from Nico. Man, he's still got boost. No, he's missed it. Nico back to back saves, bailing him out. I thought for sure that was going to be a goal. Seeing Manny miss twice. That is some scary, scary thoughts. Looks like it's back over to Taroko. Their last opportunity here. The front of the car. Down to Vegas, a full tank. Dribble, dribble, dribble. Manny takes it away, and that'll do it. Nico and Manny take it. GG's. Nico and Manny moving on to the winner's finals to play against 4-4-5. If you're a fan of Dream Team, though, they're not out of it yet. They're going to go down into the lower bracket to play one best of one. And if they win that, they're back to best of threes. Best of luck to them. But uh, we're going to be following the, uh, the winners forward to the winner's finals.